and some of these servers are great i just feel that as great as, as great as some of these proposals are damn i forgot my lines what to do with bromley north Bromino Station is a Zone 4 National Rail Service in South East London. The station is operated by South Eastern and is the terminus of the short Bromley Line branch with an intermediate stop at Sunridge Park. The station opened on the 1st of January 1878 and became Grade 2 listed with its rebuild in 1926. Before 1976, there were direct services to London terminus such as London Bridge, London Cannon Street and London Charing Cross. These direct services were cut back to peak hours until it was completely withdrawn in 1990. The line then became a shuttle service between Bromley North and Grove Park. Passengers intending to go further on than Grove Park needed to change at Grove Park to the stations going more towards Central. The station has a three trains per hour service which is a train every 20 minutes which is quite good for a shuttle service of only two miles. If you've ever been to Bromley North, then you know that it's a prime location for a station with a huge bus interchange outside serving many places in the southeast of London, which are not well served by railways. You're probably thinking, why did they get rid of their direct services into central London if it's such a good bus interchange? Well, it's all to do with the layouts of the track at Grove Park. See, if I had some expensive After Effect animation software, you'd see an animation here right now. But sadly, I can't afford that. So you're going to get a simple drawing instead. The platforms for the stopping services at Grove Park and Hither Green are on the eastern set of tracks. This means the train would have to cross over a flat crossing across the fast services to get to the platforms. Doing this every time a train for this route came along would cause a lot of trains having to wait at red lights so the trains could cross over. It also didn't make sense for the line to have a direct service into central London because there just wasn't enough passengers to justify it. So, if South Eastern can't run through services, what else can the line be used for? Great question. There are four proposed uses for the Bromley North branch. The first I'm going to mention is the DLR extension down from Lewisham. The addition of the new road layout due to the Lewisham Gateway development has increased the complexity of an extension occurring. But let's think in hypothetical terms. If you had all the money in the world, how would an extension south of Lewisham actually work? There would have to be a tunnel entrance a little bit after Elverson Road for, them, for the DLR to go down underneath where Lucian Station is now for a new DLR Lucian Station underground for it to then travel underneath the A20 tunneling will then continue until Hither Green where there will be a spur up on the western side of Hither Green Station for one track to run down alongside the southeastern mainland to Grove Park and then it will split into two at Grove Park and to continue on the Bromley North branch from Grove Park down to Bromley North. The next proposal will be an extension of the Beckenham branch of the Tramlink. The addition of the Tramlink would not be too hard from Bromley North to Grove Park as it would just to overtake the current lines already. The problem comes with extending the tram from Beckenham Junction to Bromley North. The area in between these locations are quite hilly and residential, plus roads are one lane each direction. This makes it quite hard to put a Tramlink through here. Another option is to use the Bromley North line branch as a basis for a new Tramlink. But due to passenger numbers on this line, it doesn't really make much sense. The third option, and definitely the cheapest, would be an extension of the London Overground from New Cross. This would work by the London Overground services running alongside the South Eastern services from St John's, Lewisham, Hither Green, and then an overbridge from the Slow Lines to the Bromley North branch at Grove Park. This will also provide interchange with the DLR at Lewisham, the rest of the East London line, and London Underground. The problem is the lines between Hither Green and New Cross are already quite busy and there isn't much space to fit an extra four trains per hour in each direction on these already jam-packed lines. 
The last and probably the most ambitious of all the proposals is an extension of the Bakerloo line down to Bromley North. There are already plans to extend the Bakerloo line down to Lucian through two stations at Old Kent Road and one at New Cross Gate. So my focus is on what's going to happen south of Lucian. The easier option in my opinion is to continue tunnelling from Lucian down to Hither Green where some relaying of tracks can take place to cater for two tracks for the Bakerloo line to run down on the western side of the southeastern main line to then reach at Grove Park and then take over the Bromley North line from Grove Park. The more exciting option in my opinion and the more beneficial which I'll explain the reason why afterwards is to tunnel from Lucian down through Ladywell, Catford Bridge and then from Catford Bridge tunnel to Grove Park and then have a spur upwards where the Bakerloo line will take over the Grove Park to Bromley North Branch going through Sunbridge Park. A way to make that option a bit more cost effective is for the Bakerloo line after Lucian to go up and run alongside the southeastern trains from the Hayes Branch at Ladywell and Catford Bridge and then for it to go underground after Catford Bridge to tunnel through to Grove Park and then go back above ground at Grove Park to take over the Bromley North Branch. The reason I think this is the most logical option is there is no railway connections between these heavily populated areas of Grove Park and Catford. They are connected by four London buses, where only three serve the highly populated residential area in between. As great as some of these options are, they're very far away from becoming reality. I guess we have to survive with the class 466s for now. Let me know what you think about the proposals that I've talked about in this video below and tell me if there's any that you've hypothesized about yourself. Thank you for watching there. Eh? See ya. Alright. To where? Warden? London. London, no, no, no. You'd have to get this train and then change at Grove Park. So you have to, when this train comes, yeah, it's two stops and you have to change for another train. What, what train? Um, Grove Park. Where, where, where are you trying to go to London? Where are you trying to go to London? I would say walk, do you know where Bromley South Station is? It's 10 minute walk. 10, yeah, so search on your phone. Search on your phone, it'll be better. Because I don't know how to, it's a, like left and right, it's lots of left and right. But if you walk to Bromley South Station, there's a train that goes directly to Victoria. Yeah. But search it on your phone is better. Just search how to walk there. But Bromley South Station, it's alright. Wow. Um,